You're listening to Stream, 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 the podcast that tells you what streaming on platform for subscription, rent, or buy. I'm going to talk about movies and television seasons coming out the week of April the 16th. I'm going to start off with the 13th season of Ancient Aliens. There is 11 episodes on Hoopla, 12 episodes on Hulu, 13 episodes on Peacock and Peacock Premium, and 14 episodes on on History Channel and Direct TV. Or you could buy 11 episodes on Voodoo or the whole season 13 on Amazon Prime Video and Apple iTunes. All right, now to the movies. On April the 15th, coming out streaming, it's a movie called Nobody. 82% on tomato meter, 94% audience score. Hutch Mansell, an underestimated and overlooked dad and husband, taking life's indignities on the chin and never pushing back. A nobody. When two thieves break into his suburban home one night, Hutch declines to defend himself or his family, hoping to prevent serious violence. His teenage son, Blake, is disappointed in him and his wife, Becca, seems to pull only further away. The aftermath of the incident strikes a match to Hutch's long-simmering rage, triggering dormant instincts and propelling him on a brutal path that will surface dark secrets and lethal skills. In a barrage of fists, gunfire, and squealing tires, Hutch must save his family from a dangerous adversary, and ensure that he will never be underestimated as a nobody again. It is rated R for brief drug use, bloody images, language throughout, and strong violence. It's a mystery and thriller action comedy. Directed by Ilya Nashuller. Produced by Kelly McCormick, David Light, Braden Aftergood, Bob Odenkirk, and Mark Provisero. Written by Derek Kolstad. It went out in theaters on March the 26th. It is one hour and 32 minutes long by Unkirk Provisero Entertainment. 87 North. 82 Films. Some of the cast and crew. Michael Ironside is Eddie Williams. RZA is Harry Mansell. Christopher Lloyd is Hutch's father. Alexei Serbryakov as Yulian Kuznetsov, Connie Nielsen as Becca Mansell, and Bob Odenkirk as Hutch Mansell. And this one is streaming for rent only on Apple iTunes, Amazon Video, Google Play, YouTube, Fandango Now, Voodoo, Microsoft Store, Redbox, DirecTV, and Alamo On Demand. Alright, the rest of the movies are on April the 16th. The first one, Killer Among Us. No tomato meter rating, but it's got 100% on the audience score. On the 4th of July, a rookie female cop partners with a veteran detective to save a teenage girl from a radicalized serial killer. It is the other mystery and thriller. Directed by Charlie Sharfman. Produced by Charlie Sharfman. Dan Clifton and Bernard Hunt written by Charlie Sharfman and Daniel Leitenberg it was it's also in theaters today limited it's one hour and 20 minutes long some of the cast and crew Stephen W. Tenner as Stark Getz Andrew Richardson as Vince Angelique Zambrana as Evelyn Bruce McVitie as Corbuki Amani Lewis as Rick, Ricky, Yasha Jackson as Alicia Parks. And this one is streaming for rent or buy on Amazon Video, Apple iTunes, Google Play, YouTube, Fandango Now, Voodoo, Microsoft Store, Redbox, and DirecTV. And now, Vanquish. 
Five percent on tomato meter, fourteen percent audience score. This movie shows what desperation could drive a person to do. A mother, Victoria, is trying to put her dark past as a Russian drug courier behind her, but retired cop Damon forces Victoria to do his bidding by holding her daughter hostage. Now, Victoria must use guns, guts, and a motorcycle to take out a series of violent gangsters or she may never see her child again. It's rated R for some sexual material, bloody violence, language, and drug use. It's a mystery and thriller, action, crime, directed by George Gallo, produced by Nate Adams, David E. Ornston, and Richard Salvatore. Written by George Gallo and Sam Bartlett. It's also in theaters. It's one hour and 36 minutes long by March on Productions. Some of the cast and crew. Ekaterina Baker as Galina. Nick Valelonga as Detective Stevens. Julie Lott as Governor Ann Driscoll. Patrick Muldoon as Agent Monroe. Ruby Rose as Victoria, and Morgan Freeman as Damon. And this one is for rent on Flix Fling, or you can rent or buy it on Redbox, Apple iTunes, Amazon Video, Google Play, YouTube, Fendigo Now, Voodoo, Microsoft Store, and DirecTV. Monday, 49% on Tomato Meter, 73% audience score. Mickey and Chloe, two Americans in their mid-thirties living in Athens, meet in the heat of summer one whirlwind weekend. The chemistry between them is undeniable. When Chloe's time in Greece is drawing to a close, she decides to give up her high-fly job back home and explore whether one weekend's passion can blossom into something more. The director follow-up of the festival sensation, Suntan, is a fun, sensuous romance about how love gets in the way of life and life gets in the way of love. It's rated R for sexual content, drug use, pervasive language, nudity, graphic nudity. It's a drama romance directed by Argyris Padamitropoulos. Sorry if I mispronounced that. I probably did. Christos V. Constantakopoulos. Brian Kavanaugh Jones, Damien Jones, Agaris Papadimitropoulos, Deanna Barillari. Uh, sorry. Rob Hayes is the writer along with Agaris Papadimitropoulos. Uh, it's also in theaters. It's one hour and 56 minutes long by Blonde Audiovisual Productions. Valero House Productions, Protagonist Pictures, Automatic Entertainment. Some of the cast and crew, Andreas Constantinau as Christos, Ellie Tringau as Aspa, Dominique Tipper as Bastion, Yorgos Perpasopoulos as Argyris, Denise Gal as Chloe and Sebastian Stan as Mickey. And this one is streaming for rent on Apple iTunes, Amazon Video, Google Play, YouTube, Voodoo, Microsoft Store, and Direct TV. Jacob's Wife, 85% on Tomato Meter, 63% on the audience score. Anne is married to a small town minister and feels like her life and marriage have been shrinking over the past 30 years. After a chance encounter with the master, she discovers a new sense of power and an appetite to live bigger and bolder than before. As Anne is increasingly torn between her enticing new existence and her life before, the body count grows and Jacob realizes he will have to fight for the wife he took for granted. It is a horror movie directed by Travis Stevens, produced by Barbara Crampton, Bob Portal, Travis Stevens, Enderpool Singh, written by Kathy Charles, 
Mark Steensland, and Travis Stevens. It's also in theaters, limited. It's one hour and 38 minutes long by AMP International and iVox. Some of the cast and crew, Sarah Lind as Carol Fetter, Mark Kelly as Bob Fetter, Nisha Bell as Amelia Humphreys, Body Aarons as The Master, Larry Fessenden as Pastor Jacob Fetter, and Barbara Crampton as Ann Fetter. And this one is for rent on DirecTV, or you can rent or buy it on Google Play, YouTube, Apple iTunes, Amazon Video, Fandango Now, Voodoo, Microsoft Store, and Redbox. The Courier. 87% on tomato meter, 95% on the audience score. Now this is a true life spy thriller. The story of an assuming, unassuming British businessman, Ravel Wynn, recruited to one of the greatest international conflicts in history. At the behest of the UK's MI6 and a CIA operative, he forms a covert, dangerous partnership with Soviet officer Oleg Penkovsky. And in an effort to provide crucial intelligence needed to prevent a nuclear confrontation and defuse the Cuban Missile Crisis. It's rated PG-13 for smoking throughout, partial nudity, brief starting language, and violence. It's a history, drama, mystery, and thriller. Directed by Dominique Cook. Produced by Adam Ackland, Rory Atkin, Ben Browning, and Ben Pugh. Written by Tom O'Connor. It is one hour 51 minutes long by 42, Sunday March, and Film Nation Entertainment. Some of the cast and crew, Anton Lesser as Bertrand, Rachel Brosnahan as Emily Donovan, James Schofield as Cox, Vladimir Chuprikov as Nikita Khrushchev, Marab Nenins as Oleg Pendovsky and Benedict Cumberbatch as Gravel Wynn. And this one is streaming for rent only on Amazon Video, Google Play, YouTube, Fendigo Now, Voodoo, Microsoft Store, Redbox, and DirecTV. Alright, and the last one, Gunda. 97% on tomato meter, 65% on the audience score. Experimental cinema in its purest form, Gunda chronicles the unfiltered lives of a mothered pig, a flock of chickens, and a herd of cows with masterful intimacy. Using a stark transcendent black and white cinematography and the farm's ambient soundtrack, master director Victor Kosakowski invites the audience to slow down and experience life as the subjects do, taking in their world with a magical patience and an otherworldly perspective. Gunda asks us to meditate on the mystery of animal consciousness and reckon with the role humanity plays in it. It's rated G. It's a documentary directed by Victor Kosakowski, produced by Anita Rehoff Larson. Jocelyn Barnes and Susan Rockefeller, written by Victor Kosakowski, Anara Vera. It's also in theaters, limited. It is one hour and 33 minutes long by Norwegian Film Institute, Laverture Films, Hellstone Films, Frit Ord Foundation, Sant and Usant, Empathy Arts, Media Program of the European Union. Artemis Rising Foundation and Storyline Studios. Alright. And that one is... Uh, I can't find a stream anywhere. So, there you go. It says it's streaming, but yet I can't find it anywhere. So, anyways. There you go for the week of April the 16th. Have fun watching the movies. This show is brought to you by Heartland Production Entertainment. If you'd like to help to make the show better, go to patreon.com slash heartlandpae.